Hi everyone and welcome to my channel Enchanted Moonlight A S M R My name is Natalie for those of you who are new to my channel, hello and welcome. For those of you who are regular viewers, welcome back. sharing with you June's edition of my Look Fantastic Beauty Box. Now Look Fantastic is one of two beauty box subscriptions I do. I do this one and I do Glossy Box. This month my look fantastic box has come first so I thought while it's nice and quiet and very calm I would record this video for you now I pay £13 a month for my look fantastic subscription um, because I do a 12 month rolling subscription if you just wanted a one-off box say if you saw this video and liked this box it would cost you £15 I do have a referral link in the description box below where you could get some money off your first box um, I think it's definitely, definitely worth it. I really, really do. I have so many gorgeous, wonderful beauty products now. Um, things I'd never have gone out and bought. And yeah, I think that's probably one of the main reasons I do it. Because I get to try new brands. Um, and I can see what works for me and what doesn't so yeah if you would like to subscribe to look fantastic please do use my referral link in the description box below so let's get stuck in to this box this month's box is beautiful it's such a gorgeous colour the bottom as well so it's pinks and purples and blues and greens and yellow it's just so so nice now there's always a little quote on the inside so the inside is this beautiful mauve colour it says, be so good, they can't ignore you. I love that. I really do. I do love the little quotes in, in the lids of Look Fantastic boxes. Yeah, so just remember, be so good, they can't ignore you. So this is how the book comes. You get a little booklet which tells you about the products this is called the beauty box edit in the booklet we get a little sneak peek as to what's coming in July's boxes oh wow where's this year going it's going too quick too too quick let's have a little look at the sneak peek This 
is what is coming in next month's box and this is a by Terry Hyaluronic Hydra Powder we're going to get 4 grams the loose powder contains whipped hyaluronic acid that fills in pores and imperfections for smoother more even toned results it camouflages blemishes and blurs fine lines for a smoother younger looking canvas can't wait to try that we've had a couple of um, lip glosses by Terry and they are lovely um, we have a gorgeous rose one oh and yeah it's so so nice so so nice so let's pull back the tissue paper and I will reveal to you what's in this one's box normally comes with a little sticker on it but mine doesn't appear to have one this month that's fine in this month's box what I'll do is I will go through the booklet and read what each product is the only thing I can't do is I cannot tell you how much each product is worth um, obviously look fantastic don't do that but glossy box do so yeah let me just find the pages I need here we go so this is the first product this was last month's sneak peek it's by Disciple what spot dots and there's two sticker sheets containing 12 now this for me isn't a product I would use um, I don't really suffer with spots and blemishes I haven't done um, I was very lucky growing up but obviously I have a 17 year old daughter who occasionally has breakouts so I will probably pass this on to her it's vegan and cruelty free which obviously I love I don't buy any product that's been tested on animals let's have a little read in the book what is it? what spot? Are the perfect quick fix solution for stressed out skin calming redness protecting from infection and skin picking and injecting a boost of natural silatic acid to help detox block pores How to use wash and completely dry the area remove the film cover and apply to the target area don't use face oils or other products before use wear for six hours or overnight and replace if needed so yeah like I said I would not use those I don't feel the need to so I will be passing those on to my 17 year old daughter ok 
Okay, next we have this. This is by Nooks Very Rose Micellar Water. I've never tried this one. I tend to sort of buy the, the Garnier one. So I will be interested to see how this one compares to that. Have you guys ever used this one? No, it says very rose. I'm going to have to have a smell. It's not very powerful in the rose scent. It's quite subtle. Which is nice. I know rose isn't sort of everybody's cup of tea. Like lavender isn't mine. Three in one soothing micellar water. It does smell really nice though. Really does. Let's have a little read in the book. What is it? A calming formula designed to cleanse skin without trying it out. Ideal for lifting build-ups as well as stubborn pigments. The Marcella water purifies your complexion, leaving it comfortable and nourished. How to use. In the morning and evening, Gently apply with a cotton pad soaked in micellar water to the face and eyes. I'm quite looking forward to trying that one. So yeah, that'll be really, really nice. Like I said, it's not overpowering with the rose scent. It's very, very subtle. And yeah, I can't wait to try that I'm actually I think in the bottle I've got open I've got about that much left so this will definitely be the next one I try okay on to product number three and it's this it's quite a big product this one and I'm loving the colors it's like a gorgeous pink but like a metallic pink so this is a product by bubble tea I love their products honestly until I started doing my beauty boxes I'd never heard of bubble tea um, but yeah I've got a hand cream, um, moisturisers, I love, so so love their products. Now this is a body scrub and this is in the scent Watermelon, oh how nice is that? Suitable for vegans, let's just have a little look see if it's got a protective has so I can't really smell it but yeah no watermelon is such a lovely lovely scent I I think I know it's not everybody's cup of tea but I really do like it gently polish your way to smooth skin with this exfoliating watermelon Body scrub. There is a hundred mil in this tubing, but I do. I love the colour of the tubing. Yeah, this gorgeous metallic pink. Let's have a little look in the booklet. What is it? 
gently polish your way to glowing smooth skin with this exfoliating sweet scented watermelon body scrub from Bubble Tea, suitable for vegans. How to use? Gently lather and scrub over your body in the shower and wipe clean. Can't wait to use that, really really can't. That's going to be, yeah, pop straight into the bathroom when I finish this video. Okay, so product number four. We've actually got six products in this box this month. I think we had seven last month. Maybe even a few more. I can't remember, to be honest. Because um, last month was the summer bag, which was lovely. Um, yeah. Let's go to product number four, which is this one, which is hiding down here. I'm loving the colours in this month's box of the of the products. They're all really bright and lovely. Now this is by Gatinu. That's probably wrong. Gatinu. And this is a radiant enhancing. Gourmet Gourmage. There's 15ml here. Um, I'm not quite sure. I'm trying to look at the booklet at the same time. So it is another exfoliator. Okay, this one is for your face and neck to see if it's got it doesn't have a little bit of a smell it smells really fruity really really fruity oh I like that I do like that So yeah, 15ml, it does say on it limited edition, so let's have a little read. What is it? A unique balm to oil exfoliator with AHAs. including hyaluronic acid and vitamin C reveal a renew and naturally radiant complexion with the perfect exfoliator for sensitive skin and for those experience, experiencing breakouts and clogged pores dull skin, uneven skin tone and pigmentation how to use. Apply generously to the skin all over the face and neck. Massage in circular motions until the texture liquefies. Leave for once two minutes before rinsing off with warm water. So it is an, exfoliati an exfoliating product for your face. Oh, I'm really looking forward to trying that. Obviously, because, you know, I have my own little regime that I do. And, like, trying to find a really good face exfoliator can be quite difficult at times, I, th I think. But, yeah, I'm going to give that one a try and see, see how my skin feels afterwards. Um... Like I said, I have quite a few and I try not to open them until I've used 
the previous one up. Sometimes it is quite difficult because I'm like, oh, I want to try that one now. Um, but yeah, I do, I do try my hardest not to. Okay, on to product number five. And it's this. And it's by the brand Ico. It's a brow gel. It's a clear brow gel. I don't personally use these. I never have done. Can I say I ever will? I don't know. Um, I don't tend to do anything with my eyebrows. They are really full and thick. Um, even like obviously when I've had them waxed, I still don't do anything with them. Um, yeah, I'm not sure whether or not I would use this product at the moment. That could change. Um, there is a full mil in this little tube, so it is clear. Let me just show you the wand on it. Oh, that's quite thick. It's a little tiny wand. That is really quite thick. Let's just have a little read. Ico Brow Gel Clear 4ml What is it? Lock brows into place with the Ico Clear Brow Gel Waterproof and strong hold The setting gel is designed to set brow hairs in place for up to 24 hours There is a list of ingredients as well Magnolia, Bark Extract and Green tea leaf extract how to use brush through brows to set hairs in place I know obviously um, ideas of makeup and what have you have changed an awful lot over the years um, obviously when I first started wearing makeup you had foundation blusher eyeshadow Mascara lipstick, that's all you had. You didn't have, you know, bronzing powders, um, setting powders, you didn't have anything like that. And we certainly didn't have brow gels. So, yeah, that's probably why it's not a product I'd use. Um, my daughter Abby would probably use that. So, yeah, that would probably go to her, I, I would imagine. Right, so we have one more product left. Obviously I can see it in the booklet. I am really, really sure that I already have this product. And if it is what I think it is, it's so nice, honestly, so, so nice. So it's by the brand Lottie London. is definitely the one I've got. This is an eyeshadow and it's called Golden Hour. If I remember rightly it is a beautiful gorgeous gold colour. I don't actually use it as an eyeshadow I, to, I tend to do, because I'm not going to open this one because I've already got one open. What I tend to do with it is I pop it on an eyeshadow brush, but then I dab it on my cheekbones just before or just after I put my blusher on, just to give it that little bit of glow, a little bit of shimmer. This is, it's beautiful. It's, it's so golden, honestly. So, yeah, I know... You're probably going, oh, Natalie, eyeshadow on your cheekbones. But I just, yeah, I just do it. And I think it, it, I think it looks good. Other people may not. But I'm so glad we've been given another one of these. 
So Lottie London Power Foil Golden Hour What it is, give your lids an extra glittery look with the Lottie London Power Foil A sparkly product that adds a metallic sheen to the top of any colour Apply quickly and reap the benefits of the intense pigment without needing to add multiple layers. It's suitable for vegans, it's cruelty and gluten free. How to use? Apply with your fingertips a shadow or liner brush to create a pop of colour. So yeah, like I said, I tend to just dab a little bit on my cheekbones. Don't think I've ever worn it as an eyeshadow. But maybe I should give it a go. Try it as an eyeshadow. Put a base colour on. A very light base colour. And then just, yeah, sweep that over the top. I'm going to try that. I am going to try that. Um, because next Friday, on the 17th, I am off again to go and see Duran Duran live in concert. Can't wait for that. Really, really can't. Super excited for that one. So, yeah. Going back to the 80s, it's got to be a lot of colour, hasn't it? Got to be a lot of colour. Those were the days when we wore pink and blue eyeshadow. Yeah. I know. So, for those of you who remember, like, the 80s makeup where we all thought we were cool and trendy with our pink and blue eyeshadow. I will be going in gold this time. So I'm going to pop the products back into the box. So the brow gel. The Lottie London gorgeous gold eyeshadow. The face and neck scrub. The very rose micellar water. Gorgeous watermelon bubble tea body scrub. And the Disciple What Spot Dots. We'll just Hold the tissue paper back over. Like so. Pop the book clear. Back on top. I am really quite happy with this month's box. I know I've said there is a couple of products that I won't use. But that's fine, they will get gifted on to family who so I'm sure will love them. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I hope you've all enjoyed this video. Until next time everybody.